Well, the Walton football team's storybook season came to an end last night, but throughout the year, the Braves had a handful of nail biting finishes. One player that helped secure the 11 and one record kicker Mastin Joyner. If we get inside the 40 yard line, well, at least we got a chance to get three points on any drive and there's nothing more deflating than to drive the length of the field and not get any points. So it's good to know that you got a chance to get three at all times. Joyner is eight for 10 this season for field goals with a couple of those successful kicks in game winning situations. Back in week five of the regular season, the Braves were forced into their second double overtime at South Walton. It was all coming down to Joyner for the second straight week where he secured the 34 to 31 win with a walk off kick. It was a short kick and I felt like I could make it and it was just a routine kick for me, but there was a lot of pressure. All the students stood behind the field goal and everything, but it went through and it was a good moment. These high pressure situations aren't new for Joyner. In his first year on the team, it came down to three points when the Braves hosted Mariana. And just like this season, Joyner came through. That Mariana game is probably one of my highlights of all time. My first year, we beat him 10 to seven and he, he did kick the game winner. And I think it's bigger than anyone's he's had this year. Over the years, Joyner has solidified his name on the roster, but it was just by chance that he ended up on this team. I actually found him on the tennis courts because he was the only name I could pronounce on the soccer team. So I went to the tennis match because I already played tennis and I asked his mom and dad, I said, can he come out and kick for us? And his mom said, oh no, no way. I said, he ain't got to hit nobody. He ain't got to make no tackles. Just let him come kick. So he come out his sophomore year and he fell in love with it. That decision to play football has landed Joyner with a scholarship to play at the collegiate level at Austin P. I always thought about kicking, but it uh, never became serious until coach actually asked. And then all those moments happened for me, and I'm just lucky to be able to live through this. While the Walton football season has come to an end, Joyner still has a full year ahead playing soccer and tennis.